California has an ocean and southern Minnesota a sea of green. But tucked in a corner of Olmstead County, a splash of color. These are all first time bloomers. Never bloomed before. What started as a daughter's birthday gift of a handful of gladiolus bulbs has blossomed. Obsession, I guess. On the farm of Barb. All colors. And John Meyer. I'm gonna be cutting over here then, 10,000. So then next year we'd have 20,000 and pretty soon we quit talking about thousands and talking about acres. So I'll cut this one here. Now four and a half acres of gladiolus. Oh, they're gorgeous. Lovingly hybridized. Here's three small ones. In a field of gleams. You start making another bridge. We've named some after grandchildren. Sasha Lynn is na um, named for our second granddaughter. This is mine that grandpa named after me, Mr. E. Cloud dancing. Grown for flower shows. This is King's Kisses. And bulbs. The glads, for the most part, are not for sale. We could sell them, yes. Instead, John and Barb have chosen we're coming up to enrich others. If you have a patient you're visiting, we have free flowers. Three or four times a week, the Myers deliver gladiolus bouquets. It's called Ebony Beauty. To St. Mary's Hospital at the Mayo Clinic. Enjoy. That bouquet is going to Connor Prelip's grandpa, who was badly hurt in a motorcycle crash. Lots of red ones, because grandpa likes red. <laughs> so enjoy them. And that enjoy bouquet, them. Emma Mendoza will deliver to. My mom, she had a stroke. So I'm going to take it to my daughter that's in the epilepsy center. Kelly Tudor and dozens of others. It's so, so pretty. We'll also know the joy. There you go. You. Enjoy. Thank you. Of delivering glads. Brighten the day, okay. yes. To a grandmother. She'll love them, yes. To a wife. A this is her favorite flower. To a son. Glad lady and glad man <laughs> gave him these flowers, and he will be ecstatic. Oh. I love to watch the flowers from this angle going down the hall. So we leave here with really always a good feeling. Their fields, a tad emptier. Their hearts overflowing. This is true. Yep, exactly. 